Hi, YouTubies. It's me, Zachary Michael. Hi, hello. How are you doing? Um, the, the Twitch, <laughs> the Twitch chat just got put in timeout. They just got put in timeout for a little bit because they were, they were over here causing a ruckus, putting 69s in the chat, trying to get me to start sooner. All right. They know what they did, so don't don't let them act like I was the one in the wrong when they start saying it in the chat. When they start saying it in the chat where they're like, oh, I've been de dehumanized. No, they haven't. They, they know the rules here. They know the rules here and they were not following them, okay? So t today we have the highly requested British Lisa back on our screens. She did a charity shop haul, which is kind of like thrift stores in the UK, to my understanding. They're, they're similar, and maybe the proceeds go to charity. I don't know. I don't know how it works. I'm not from the UK. I'm not an expert in the UK. And today we're doing a prediction about whether or not she'll talk about poo. Anything related to poo, I will be the final judge, decision maker about that, okay? I will be the one that decides if if something counts as discussion of poo, all right? So if y'all are getting ready to fight with me in the chat, I'm not doing it today. I'm just, I'm simply not. I'm simply not doing it today with y'all. Um, so with that being said, my dear Twitch viewers and or if you're on the YouTube and you wanna put some 69s in the comment, go ahead and put some 69s in the chat if you're ready to start today's reaction. Now is the time to do that. Now is the time to to do it. If you you bit I know you've been itching to put 69s in the chat. Now's the time to do it. Now would be the time. Okay, look love, at that. Love, love my cream all wheat, wheat. Can we hurry this up? I gotta get to my dog's dinner. They're starving. <laughs> They're starving? You should prioritize taking care of your dogs, for sure. For sure, for sure. Now, see, this is what I'm talking about. Look at all of y'all responsibly putting 69s in the chat when I ask you to. Oh, it's just so magical. <laughs> it's just so magical. I really appreciate it. That's so kind of you. Um, and I think I'm ready to get to get to. So let's, um, uh, let's get to get to. I also should say as a preface, I don't know if this is going to be funny or not, but this is one of the first videos she posted that wasn't like 40 minutes long. And so that's why we're watching it. Let me make sure she's at an appropriate volume. Feel free to let me know if I need to turn her up. I'm loving this DIY Chanel. I'm guessing Chanel didn't make this. This doesn't look like something Chanel would actually make. But this DIY Chanel dresser behind her. Let's get to, let's get to. Hello, 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 hello. It's me, welcome back to my chat. I know, hello everyone, how are you all doing? I hope you all do doing good. I know, I know what you're thinking. Gosh, she's got the moves. I have, I tell you. <coughs> If I went for a dancing competition, do you know who's winning, didn't you? Me. Oh, uh, I need to. I need to see her on. Uh, when I do, you know I need to see her on Strictly Come Dancing, which is like the British version of Dancing with the Stars. We need to get her on Strictly. She needs to be on Strictly. Oh my gosh, she does kind of sound like that professional gaslighter. Once I make my move. <laughs> Once I make my move, you're free to check the king. You're free to check the king. Oh, I should also say, because somebody just in the chat asked me to put subtitles on, and I, and I did add them. Um, I should say that, I, and I will correct myself as many times as needed, because it's my fault. Uh, but uh, there was a time where people sent me several messages saying that she said the n-word in a video um and i i prematurely said something about that on a stream and come to find out that people i didn't watch it myself which is the problem i should have watched it and come to find out that people uh just misheard her accent okay <laughs> so 
you can't. There must be another way. I don't have a good British accent at all, but she does kind of sound like Ron. She does kind of sound like Ron. So anyways, I just want to say, sorry for putting out that narrative without doing the the fact checking. And now that we're here together, I just want to, I just want to put it all out there. But say, your shoulders, it's very hard to get those shoulders moving like this, all right? <laughs> Hope you're all doing it. Oh, anyway, how are you all? Oh, hey, I hope you're good. You all? I have got a very small charity shop haul today because Let's go. um Let's go. I had to go and give Callie's uh uniform back. She's no longer working at Costa. Very long oh. story. I'll let her tell you about it. Oh. Um but it sounds like drama. Well, I'll just leave it there. <laughs> I'll let Callie tell you all about it. Um, so oh, I, I need was to there, know. I thought I'd have a little look around, uh, which I did. And I found a couple of good bits. Oh, do you know what? I went into one charity shop. And again, I thought, you're taking the Uncle Bertie's. You are. Yeah, you're there ta- was, it's wait, you're, ta- you're taking the Uncle Bertie's. <laughs> you're taking the Uncle Bertie's. Can somebody can somebody translate that for me? You're taking the uncle. Is that like taking the piss? You're taking the Uncle Birdies. Let let me hear that again. I found a couple of good bits. Oh, do you know what? I went into one charity shop, and again I thought you're taking the Uncle Birdies. You where know. where does that come from? Well, who's Uncle Birdie? It's Cockney slang. Okay, I don't know a lot about Cockney anything. I know I know about that cock. Me, <laughs> you know what I'm saying. <laughs> it means you're ripping me off. Okay, okay. Cockney slang. You all gotta give it up. It's so tired. <laughs> Wait, who's gotta give it up, Jess? I don't understand. You want Lisa to give up her Cockney slang? That feels like a lot to ask her to do. Well. There was, it said designer Ralph. So everything on the Ralph was meant to be, what was designer? They had a polo Ralph Lauren jacket on there. 150 quid. Wow. Rip off. And you're, you're, quid. Some body you're taking the has Uncle Bernie's. given this to you. Do you know what they said to me? Yeah. <laughs> they said, but the reason sometimes these things are marked up is because we're trying to make as much money as we can for the charity and I said I understand that but in the long run you're also ripping off the public oh. because it's been given to you not, not her out here fighting with the, the, the employee at the charity shop not that not that not, not that it's like you need to spend a stream looking up cockney slang they're hilarious I learned it from my hubby he's British um, she is boxing the charity shop workers for real. Her lipstick looks sticky. It's probably the lip gloss. Isn't, doesn't lip gloss sometimes make it sticky? Certain lip glosses. I mean, we're talking 100% profit here. We're not talking, to, you know, we're talking 100% profit. Yeah, but also Lisa, respectfully British Lisa, you don't have to buy it. Also, you just like, if if you don't think it's a fair price, you don't have to buy it. Isn't it, 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 to put it up for 150 pounds if you go to Bista or somewhere like that you can probably get a brand new one for 150 pounds in the sales it just doesn't they just don't buy my it. mind it does so you know I only like to go for the old um bargy wargies but then... <laughs> the old bargy wargies <laughs> the, the old Bargy rargies. Don't they have to pay staff and utilities? I don't know how the charity shops work, but I would assume I would assume they still gotta they still gotta pay for for like some level of expenses. It's probably not a, like pure one hundred percent profit. Why? Before I show you the little charity shop haul, you some of the day is t- I don't know what I'm doing that for. It's not my one thousand yet. <coughs> oh, oh. God, I swallowed too much air. Air, not air. It's you think you swallowed too much what? <coughs> God, I swallowed too much air. Air, not air. Oh, air, not hair. Air, not hair. She's sm- she's choking on air. It's time for my laugh on a loo with you, girl. Lisey Lou. You ready? This is a long one. Three elderly sisters shared a house together. 
one evening, the 96 year old went upstairs to have a bath. As she was stepping into it, she paused. Then she called out to her two sisters, was I getting into the bath or getting out of the bath? You old fool, said the 94 year old, I'll come up and see. When she got halfway up the stairs, she paused. Then she called downstairs to her other sister. Was I going up the stairs or coming down there? <laughs> she, what is she reading? So, if I recall correctly, she she does she's very Amberlynn Reed coded in some kind of ways. Like back when Amberlynn would buy a book and she's she'd be like, "I've got to read a fun fact from this book in every video. That's gonna be that's gonna be so fun." Uh, British Lisa does that too, except with with like joke books and that she does have a fun fact book too. Her 92 year old sister was sitting at the kitchen table drinking a cup of tea and thought to herself, I'll never get that forgetful, knocking on the wood. She knocked twice on the table, shook her head and called out, I'll be up to help you both as soon as I see you at the door. <laughs> Laughing too. <laughs> I'm not laughing. I don't under. Why would I be laughing, Lisa? Lisa, you ain't said anything funny. <laughs> you ain't said anything funny to laugh at. Party games for your second childhood. Wait, was that it? What? <laughs> Wait, that was the story. That was it. That, there was a joke in there? I thought there was going to be more. I thought maybe we hadn't got to the joke yet. <laughs> I thought we hadn't gotten to the... That was it, though. She thought the knocks on the wood was someone at the door. Her own knocks on the wood was someone at the door. <laughs> She's so forgetful that she thought the knocking on the table... Oh, my God. I... Okay. That was a banger of a joke. Hilarious. Hilarious. <laughs> so funny. Sag, you're it. What? Second childhood. Sag, you're it. Kick the bucket. Simon says something incoherent. Hide and pee. Musical. Hi hide and pee. That's good. Come on. No, bestie, ain't I'm I'm sorry to tell you, none of this has been funny. You you continue to just get less funny as you keep going on. That's good. Is someone knocking on the door? Okay. He's so old that when he orders a hard boiled egg in a calf, I ask for the money up front. That's gone right over my head. <laughs> anyway, you also... This whole bit has gone right over my head, bestie. <laughs> Do you need to go, Poe? Do you need to go see what's going on out there? Well, that's time of day. This is a haul video, yeah. I said, you know, that's time of the day. It's on my 1,000. <laughs> no, I don't think, just to be clear, I draw people and animals. Just to be clear, I don't believe that this was a book that she got from the charity shop. She does this in all of her videos. She shares, like, a fun fact and a joke. <laughs> I don't think she got it from the charity shop. This is not a part of the haul. This is just her additional nonsense that she's adding to it. This book is never ending. Because we're only here, look. Oh my god. That's too bad. We need to we need to be done. Between 1960 and 1977, the secret number authorizing US presidents to launch. Nuclear missiles was zero 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 zero. Some hack up could easily get into that. I mean, that's ridiculous. <laughs> or as Callie would say when she was little, that's dickless. That's dickless. <laughs> that's dickless. She used to say, "Mum, that dickless." <laughs> also, I just, I just don't think this is real. I just don't think this was real a real fact. I <laughs> Jimmy Carter once sent a jacket to the dry cleaners with the nuclear detonation code still in the pocket. You didn't, Jimmy Carter. Oh, R.I.P. his oh, wife, Carter, though. She just passed away. What a doofus. Sorry, sorry to trauma <laughs> sorry to trauma dump in the chat. 
Also, not calling Jimmy Carter a doofus. Oh my god. Worried about his grades at law school, Richard Nixon broke into the dean's office. Who's the dean's office? <laughs> Only to discover that he was top of his class. Who's the dean's office? This is the people in charge of in charge of the the school. Oh, you're gone. The highest scoring word in Scrabble is oxyphenbutazone. Oxyphenbutazone. <laughs> Potentially earning 1,178 points. It's a drug used to treat arthritis. I'll tell you what. <laughs> that. Arthritis. I'll tell you what. Arthritis. To the doctors. They've never given me <sighs> oxyphenbutazone. <laughs> Are y'all familiar with arthritis? Not arthritis. <laughs> right, about right off, right there that page do you know what what it, it go, <coughs> i'm talking about medication right i've been given yeah you know, i don't know i told you a lot before about the generics i get different generics uh -huh. some are right some are not they've just given me a new lot and they've made me feel so terribly ill that i ain't taking them oh my god all right Bessie, so talk to your doctor. Take, i have taken them out of the box and they're all like in the bags and i've got to take them back to the chemist and say look these are the ones i want you've just given me these again which are making me really feel really ill Please, can you get me in the ones that are all right? Because I'm yeah, still going to yeah, feel ill, yeah, but yeah, not yeah. as much as I do on these Yeah, yeah, ones. yeah. Yeah, talk, just talk to your doctor, Bessie. I don't know how it works. I don't, <laughs> I don't know how it works. Straight to the chemist. I'm guessing, I'm using context clues. So when she said chemist, I was just, I'm just like, pharmacists do chemistry. <laughs> I don't. I just figured chemist was something quirky that you Brits call um, the pharmacist. That's what I I just assumed. That that was my assumption about the situation. They don't care, you know. <laughs> I've got a frog in my throat. Oh, you got something going on. You are that. hacking. I really, really do. You anyway, are hacking, um, girly pop. Oh, that's it. That's oh, it. This knee, I tell you, it ain't no fun getting old. It really ain't no fun. I tell you. I feel you, girl. I tell Bob. you all the time. How old are you? One thing or another, honestly, honestly. Anyway, so, I'll show you what I got. Love, First love, love, love my cream on I was on an alarm in the back. P-P-P-U. P-P-P-U. Mona, thanks so much for 41 months. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you, thank you. About it, but then I thought, for £3.50, can you go wrong? Go on, say it with me. You can't. You can't go wrong. Wait. So this is... Wait, did she... She paid... Oh wait, not three hundred and fifty. Three like three dollars and fifty cents, essentially. I mean, I don't know how British money works, but that's what she's saying, right? She's not saying she spent three hundred and fifty pounds. Cause then I was like, how are you gonna how are you gonna spend three hundred and fifty pounds on this, but not a hundred and fifty pounds on whatever the shirt you saw was? Can you go wrong? Go on side with me. You can't you can't you, go wrong. You sure can't. So this is a, a Ferrelli bag. It looks pretty new to me. A Ferrelli? It's like a dark blue here with a light blue here, and it doesn't look like really. What? Is it's Ferrelli fancy? Now, it was up for. Not 350 pounds being one Chantal. Not quite. Not, not quite one Chantal. Seven pounds by the looks of things. It says as seen, but they've marked it down to £3.50. Wow. Focus, yeah. And I thought, look, oh, that, that looks like a good purse for $3.50. I guess you really can't go wrong. You know what I said? I said, I'm getting here. <laughs> I think you might as well just sing the knickers. Lisa, that was so funny to me. I was literally cackling. Let's watch it again. Let's watch it again. Focus, yeah. And I thought, look, I'm getting it. You know what I said? I said I'm getting it. <laughs> oh, I thought, look, I'm getting it. 
you know what I said. I said, I'm getting it. Oh! <laughs> and I thought, look, I'm getting it. You know what I said. I said, I'm getting it. Oh! <laughs> You know what I said. I said I'm getting it. Oh. <laughs> also, look at the big ass fan right next to her. I love it. That's like an industrial ass size fan. I think you might have all just seen my knickers. Oh my god, that is so funny. <laughs> if so you did, I'm funny. sorry. I'm leaving it in. <laughs> I, I can't. She said, I don't give a shit if you saw my knickers. <laughs> it's, it's staying in. Uh, oh, British Lisa never change. I in now. So if you see me knickers and me hairy cruddy vag, I'm very <laughs> sorry. <coughs> Not the hairy cruddy vag. Oh my god. I'm dying. I'm dying. She said, and my hairy cruddy vag. Why would she say that? We didn't see it. We didn't see all that. Oh my God. I'm leaving it in. I, I can't stay in there. So if you see me knickers and me hairy cruddy vag, I'm very sorry, but there's nothing I can do about it. <laughs> there, there is something you can do about it. I mean, we didn't see all that, but there was something. You you could edit it out. There is something you can do about it. Anyway, there's that. You know why? Because I've plugged the bloody, bloody phone in on the leads, like the charger's in there, because it's running out of the charge. And as I've put the bag down, it's pulled the bloody ring light, hasn't it? Oh, it's oh all my skew. God. Hang on, let's sort this out. It's all Hang askew. On. I'm so sorry. Oh, it's okay. I'm gonna forgive you for this. Okay. Anyway, let me look inside. <laughs> she is she for real made a try on video where you full on see her nipple. She gives no fucks. I had no idea. I had no idea. I'll need that. I'll need you to send me that with a timestamp, please. Queefer madness sixty nine. Also, here we go again with the the queef names. And so many of y'all have 69 in your usernames. Y'all are uh, so special. Oh, really? I'm sorry if you see me fanny iron. <laughs> sorry if you see my fanny. Usually they take these out because they want to make sure you ain't nicked anything. Let's have a butcher's. I don't think there's a... That's the only thing it's missing. What's it missing? Um, Andal. Like, uh, like an andal. I love, I love that the Brits do not pronounce H's at the beginning of words. I love it so much. But I'm sure I could find one. But yeah, look, it looks pretty much brand new. Well, damn. So for £3.50, you can't, you can't be wrong. You can. Uh, I agree, I agree. I was in Isabel, and I see this, and it Yet they was say £8 hey, down to £4. It's okay. brand new from originally from In the Style. It is a size 24. But see, I don't know what In the Style is. Didn't you say these were like name brands or something? No, it is going to be a bit big for me, but it's like a short tuxedo jacket. And I thought it'd be nice to, like, because it is a bit big, I can wear something underneath it. Okay, you know I mean? like work. It okay, is this is this is giving boss girl, boss babe energy. I love a woman in a, in a tuxedo jacket, blazer situation type of deal. One and I don't really usually like crop stuff, but I thought, you know what I mean, I can wear a shirt. I, I mean, I've actually got a nice black and white shirt I could wear oh, underneath. Oh, absolutely. Like, like, um, the top half is like a black jumper, and it's got like white puffy sleeves, and the bottom half is No, if it's got puffy sleeves, though, you don't want to cover those up with a, a jacket. I think that would look nice, like a pair of black leggings and me black boots. I'm going to look absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> No, it's like a pair of black leggings and me black boots. I'm going to look absolutely gorge. <laughs> so, yeah. Black leggings and me black boots. I'm going to look absolutely gorge. <laughs> so, yeah. Black leggings and me black boots. I'm going to look absolutely gorge. <laughs> gorge. So, yeah. um, gorge. So, um, the back. But, yeah, it's like tuxedo. It's nice, isn't it? 
yeah, it is a size 24. Sure. So that's got to go. Sure, sure, sure. I'm going to have to take labels off. It will have to be put in the you know, wash. Wash, wash, wash. <laughs> uh, and then I've put in the you know, wash. Wash, wash. I have to be put in the you know, wash. Wash, wash, wash. Carly Wizard Lizard, thanks for gifting a sub to I Paint Burbs, which uh, also y'all should go check out the old I Paint Burbs. She is, she is uh, stunning. She is a sweet rascal. Um, now, ugh, can somebody do the shout out? For some reason, Streamlabs has me logged out and it won't let me chat in my own chat. Actually, I can do it here. Just a second. I'll do it here. I paint burbs. I got it. <laughs> I got it. I paint burb burbs who are gorge or whatever British Lisa said. Of course, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Today, um, today she was painting some beautiful wood ornaments with birds on them. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or ornaments, ornaments, yeah ornaments with the d uh and then i found this now i don't actually know what it is i'm made out of recycled fibers uh south beach active so i will google it after see i mean i could have googled it before <laughs> see how much it was worth you sure could have I, I forgot but anyway i got it from isabel and again that was eight pounds but they put it down to four Okay, I think some. I, I don't know what any of that says, so but it's okay. It's kind of like an all in one. Well, not kind of like it. What is, is it? And I think it I might can't see shit. Lisa, so I can't see now, shit. But for the summer, because it's more like cycling shorts. Oh, it's like a jumper. You see? Uh, well, she wouldn't call that a jumper. What would we call that? A bodysuit? A, a, what would we call this? Take a boo. More like cycling shorts at the bottom. Is that is that like shapewear? It's shapewear, like a romper shapewear situation type of deal. A romper. But I think this bit here is like tummy control. Oh, you're okay. gonna need it with my bouquet. I tell you, hang <coughs> over. What? I've not seen me feet in years. What? Yeah, you ain't seen your fanny in years, but we just saw it, girly pop. <laughs> We just saw it. We just saw it. <laughs> she said, I don't need to see it, but y'all can. Y'all can see my hairy, crusty vag, but I've not seen it in years. What size is it? Size. Oh, both the dogs are in here. Both of them are in here. Look at Judy down there. I didn't even hear her come in. Look at her. She knows she's on camera now. And Poe's like, Dad, give me attention. Give me attention. <laughs> I didn't even realize. It's 20 o. 20 o. Um, can Ooh, you fu can we raid Capri? Oh, I'm familiar with the old Capri Sun Poppy. He's a fellow Palestinian doing a charity stream for Palestine. Yeah, absolutely, Wauma. We will um we will do that next, or when I'm done, as long as he's still streaming, uh, we will do that. I do have a new video coming up, but I do have to take a second to make the thumbnail and everything like that, because I haven't done that yet. So it'll be a good transition for the end of the stream. I got you. I got you, bestie. Thanks so much, Wauma. Got that. And like I say, I think that would be good in the... I nearly said in the winter, not in the winter, don't listen to In the to summer. Me. In the uh, summer. Lastly, I, this year I'm only a small one, I'm ever so sad. Um, I see this and I thought it was really nice. So this was from Keach. It's from who? Uh, from it where? Was, it's size 18, £4.50, same colour like me nails. Okay. And it says on the back here, baby girl. Oh! Is oh it? my god, the juicy, the juicy track pants of it all. Yes! <laughs> Let's fucking go. It says baby girl. I just know Lisa is that kind of girl to wear something like this. I'm obsessed. Let's fucking go. Also, we need to put it in British Lisa's ear to go audition for next year's Big Brother UK. I think she would be... So fucking good on that show. We need her on it. We need to get her to go apply for it. Although I will say I kind of fell off 
of watching because it does air every single day and I just got so far behind and I'm like, I can't keep up. But I know it's over. But yeah, we need her on the next season. I think she could do it. Diamonds, look. That's the, hood. that's the hood that says baby girl. Oh, that's... Oh, I thought she was trying to say, like, that is, like, from the hood, like, the place. But that's... The, that's a... It's not track pants. It's... It seems to be, like, a, a... I think this is what the British would call a jumper, right? That This is what... Because it's got, it, like, a hoodie. To us, it's a hoodie. <laughs> Baby girl. And it is a... Again, it's another crop, which like I said, I don't really wear, but I love it. I love it. So I was like, I'm getting it. I love own. it. It's gorgeous, isn't it? That is so British Lisa and I love the colour. I know what you're all thinking. You're thinking, Lace, why are you mutton dressed as lamb, girl? <laughs> why are you mutton dressed as lamb? Is is that like a is that like a saying like she's dressing too old for her age or too young for her age or something? Is that is that what that saying means? I'm I'm learning. I'm learning. I do get that one. I'm mutton dressed mutton dressed as a lamb. I don't know. This this to me though speaks like older lady. This speaks older lady to me, honestly, truly. What you're thinking? Because it kind of reminds me of, like, the juicy ones. Listen. Yes, juicy. That's what I was saying. I'm going to come close to tell you about this. Come closer. I'm going to get closer, too. I don't care. I do literally wear whatever I want. I know people talk about me. Sometimes oh. when I'm out, I know. She said talk that talk. I can see it in their little eyes. They're talking about me. They're saying things. They're like a dog with a cup. I tell you. But I just think to myself, listen, this is to anyone... It doesn't matter how old you are, yeah? I yeah. Because the yeah, thing yeah. is, I think to myself, you know, I know there should be a, like, a stop point where you think, you know what, I, I, I'm too old to wear this mm -hmm. now. There should be, I no, suppose. No, 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 no. You wear whatever you want, girly pop. Let your freak flag fly. But then why should there be? Because I think if you want to wear it, exactly. and you think it looks alright, exactly. then do it. Cause I Say think, it. I mean, I'm probably a bit old for that, let's be fair. No, but, no. You know, Age is just I a number. I've got pink nails, and I've put on all my pink You're going to look so cute. You're going to be... I'm going to look beautiful, all right? I'm you're going to be so slay. <laughs> no, I just think you're going to day. You're going to be so slay. Exactly. People. And that is the problem I find with so... I've said this in a few of my videos. So many people, they're so worried about what everybody else is going to... Don't worry about it. <laughs> think. Do you know what it reminds me of? My lipstick are called one, like, in the corners. I remember years ago, I went to this place, right? And there was a fella there, and he started talking to me, and with every word he said, white stuff was accumulating either side of his mouth. I swear it like a rapist. He was foaming at the mouth. That's not good. By the time I walked away, I literally was swimming in his saliva. <laughs> That's not even a lie. I saw my sister tell you she was there with me that night. I was like, "Did you see his mouth?" She's like, "Did I see his mouth? He's taking the pee." Are you Are you taking the piss? I don't know his name, but I'm not to say it. She she is so bad about finishing stories. I don't know how we got on this story about this man's foamy mouth, but but here we are. Say his name was Vince, but anyway, um, but last I just you know wear what you want to wear what you want to wear. wear. Wear because what of, you, know, you wanna wear. Life is short and all that malarkey. Just do what you want to do. Absolutely. Don't listen to anyone. Say it. God but bless. Amen. To me, you're old. You're too old for that. I'll be like, mm. and I'm still gonna wear it. Yes, please. Well, that is my motto of the day. Do what you want to do and wear what you want to wear. And I'm right? gonna, I'm gonna. Anyway, listen. This it. was quite a, a shorter video than. Well, I say a shorter video than normal. Not really short. Well, it's I'm shorter still than normal. Catching up with my big brothers, and I cannot <gasps> wait for I'm a celebrity. Was I not just talking about Big Brother? I don't want to spoil anything for her if she's behind. She just uploaded this, and the 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 winner was announced last Friday. She knows. She knows where I'm at. She knows. Also, the the. I'm a celebrity, get me out of here, it has fucking Jamie Lynn Spears on it. Have you seen all the, the things of people, like, dragging her? Because in her little intro package, she's like, she's like, I'm most known for acting and singing. And people are like, girl, please, you're most known for being an awful sister to Britney Spears. Get out of here. 
get me out of here, which is starting on this Sunday, 19th, I think it is this Sunday. I cannot bleed in weight. Let's oh, go. I, abs- oh, I love Ant and Deck. Who don't love Ant and Deck? I love Ant and Deck. Anyhow, any Deck? Show, Who doesn't um, love Deck? Yeah, so Honestly. I can't say, take care of yourself. Well, not like all, so I don't all say it at all. I'm actually lying. But I'm going to say, take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. Thank you um, to all my new subs and my existing. Of um, if this is your kind of thing, please subscribe to my channel. Please. Look, I'm begging. Oh. Not a little puppy dog. Please. Oh, a little puppy dog. Um, She's talking about you. She's talking about you, up. sweetie. Press the notes. Press, press, press. She's talking press about the you. Press because it let tell you every time that little on me alone. And uh, as I say, it would mean a great deal to me. I'm trying to get a thousand subs. Uh, yeah, let's get her. And I'm grabbing let's get all, a lot of giveaways going let's on. Let's get old British Lisa to a thousand subs if you want. If you want to subscribe to her. Do I subscribe to her? Oh, yeah. I'm subscribed. Look, even I'm subscribed. So go subscribe to her. Your eyes peeled. For the giveaways and uh, you know that's link time her. It's time for me to go. So I love you all. Link much. her. Take well, care. I'll try Bye. to remember to link her in the actual video that I post. <laughs> I'll try to post her in the actual video or link her in the actual video. Otherwise, her YouTube name is Lisa Riggs, R I G G S, and you can easily also search that. Anyways, YouTubies, that's all I have for you today. Um, <laughs> So I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed the the re-upload for today. Um, and there was no mention of poo. So I'm going to give uh, the, the winner of the points to the people who picked no. There was no mention of poo today, unfortunately. <laughs> we do love a pissing and shitting and farting channel. And it just, we, we did talk a lot about... Her nether regions, though. Anyways, YouTubies, thanks so much for hanging out today. I love you all so much. Make sure to subscribe and follow me on all my social media. And uh, bye. Bye, YouTubies.